Happy Friday. What a way to start off a Friday. And the good news is Bailey comes in this morning. She's like, it is an exciting Friday. I'm like, oh, really? And she's like, yeah, I just found out 24 hours ago that I'm going to show up here. So yeah. I was at the dentist getting a good cleaning. And, and then I, they hit you up. And my like, boss was like, hey, by the way, can you do me with good today? <laughs> Absolutely. Are you going to be able to get through this hour okay after just seeing that promo for Beth Hool there? Because every time she comes on the screen, you're just like, yeah, you, you, you like blush. Because <laughs> best friends have to support best friends. I, I completely agree with you. So I'm glad that, you know, you two are like that. She's, oh, sorry. She's my girl. She's your girl. By the way, this is Bailey Hurley. I'm oh, Chris yeah. Berg, and this is North Dakota Today, in case you can't tell. So, Happy Friday. Um, uh, it's a snail brain day, you know? I mean, our brains are all over the place. We're all thinking about the weekend. And it's summertime, like... I guess there's storms coming, because why not? Right, but I, I mean, I don't know if you agree with this, but I think this summer's just been impeccable. Like, the weather's been unbelievable. So good. Opinion. It's been so cool lately, and I know lots of people are excited about that. I was living for when it was like that 90... Mm -hmm muggy like give you a hug thank you humidity. bailey hurley oh, i didn't know my. that oh. chef's kiss oh i love that <laughs> i thought you were going to be kind of like oh i want a little bit cooler no. in the fall i'm the same way like mucho mucho caliente is better oh my and like the humidity it's so good for your skin oh it's so good. <laughs> well the winter course, it does us so, thing. the winter does us so dirty <laughs> so dry so cold so like the complete opposite i'm here do you have any hot tea for us today? Yeah, but so I have hot oh, tea. Oh, you do? Yeah, I have a picture I want to show, but don't show it yet because I have a question for you. Do you believe in fate? Like, do you believe in all things? One thousand percent. All things happen for a reason. One, like, if I could be any more than a thousand percent. Air, air. Well, you already know this from when you were downtown and you happened to see a specific car there. Like, you just know how, you don't even know what I'm talking about, do you? Oh, 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 yeah, when I caught wow. my fiance. How, how am I remembering that? You're looking at me like, what? Yeah, yeah, what yeah. are you talking about? Well, something else <laughs> happened downtown. It's a fun story. So you can show the picture now. I'm so excited. So I got my wedding dress this week. Oh, wait Look a second. It. How is that fate? Wait, wait, so, you're going to have to explain Yes, 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 yes. So this is my exciting news. That's me with my mom, my sister, oh my, my best friend, my fiance's family, my aunt. Okay. Wait, which one's your, there's no mom in that picture. Where is she? Oh my gosh, she's going to die watching this. She's on the far right in the white shirt. We're like, are you serious? We're literally twins. Man, mom, whatever you're eating and drinking, like, <laughs> kudos. We always get asked if we're sisters when we go I was, get our nails I, done. I, honestly, I like that. I'm like, okay, there's no mom there. So should she take the picture or what are you talking about? <laughs> no, my mom is there. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's going to be your biggest fan after today. <laughs> she's not already? Come on, mom. <laughs> well, I think, you, I think you just went up in her books. So <laughs> here's you. my fate story. So I'm not getting married till 2022. So I wasn't planning. Wait, what? If Can you, this is one of those times where you should take your silence. <laughs> okay, I'm going to use the Bailey Hurley listening skills. <laughs> Thank you. So not getting married till 2022. Didn't think I was going to look for a dress until next spring. Last week, I go get alterations on a bridesmaid's dress that I'm in next month. And while I'm there, the store owner was like, hey, you should come next door. So I'm at Rosa's uh, Sewing and Alterations downtown. And she goes, hey, I have a bridal boutique next door. I already knew that. She's like, come look at some of the dresses that I have. Cool. Sounds great. We go in. The first dress I see when I walk in is literally the dress of my dreams, dress of my dreams. I had just texted my mom and my best friend almost an exact replica of, the, of that dress two days prior. And I was like, what? And I never thought I would find anything like that because I am a glitzy, glammy, sparkly girl. That's my only hint I'm giving you guys. Um, my fiance gets the same hint, but I was like, what? I, I, it was genuinely everything and so I went on Sunday and tried it on with my mom and my fiance's mom then tried it on again on Wednesday to show like the rest of my f some of my favorite people and I made it official like what how like how does that happen like my dress found me you can talk now I felt like Chandler there's a great Chandler like oh my you gosh. can't talk and I'm like mm -hmm. that's beautiful Bailey so that's, that, my that's fate. fantastic it's I fate. love that kudos to you no Did you stress. know it right when you saw it? Oh, absolutely. And I tried on a few other dresses just to make sure. I even tried like on a plain Jane one. Zero. You didn't trust yourself, huh? Well, I just wanted to make sure that what I liked. <laughs> and so I tried on a plain Jane. Zero sparkle in sight. I tried on the sparkly one again the second time. 
And obviously, if Did you're it, watching like, this. Did it just sing to you when you put it on? Well, I was going to say, obviously, if you're watching this, you know silence is not something I do well. <laughs> you do it very well. But, like, I'm, not, I'm never speechless. I, I, I got, all right, I will be quiet right now, but I got to say that one, that one day when we were at that oh, yeah. presser, I was like, wow. No, that's listening. But, like, I have a lot to say. Fair. I was speechless when I put this dress on. So that's exciting, and that's my exciting news. <laughs> So did it need to be altered or anything? Or just was like, okay, this is yeah, it. Yeah, there's a few things, like personal things we're going to do. Like we're going to change some things up. Because she can. It's her, like she does it all. Amazing. Wow. We highly recommend I Do Bridal in downtown Fargo. She's fantastic. It's, it's kind of by. Um, Nicole's. No, she's, she's phenomenal. So good. Alterations, anything, yes. like suits, whatever. Yes. She does it all. She did these, so she's fantastic. Oh my gosh, yes, people, get in there. So how glitzy is glitzy? Like diamonds everywhere or what? Just put your sunglasses on. Wow. But like not over the top, like not gaudy or yeah, yeah. not tasteful. Just like, yeah. You know, I sparkle, my dress sparkles. sparkles. <laughs> What'd mom say? She loved it. Oh, good. But I think she loves you now more than she loves my dress after all of your... <laughs> Any plans for hey, the weekend? I'm just being honest. Um, I, I don't know. Like, unfortunately, I'm probably going to end up having to mow the lawn. But I definitely want to go down to WAP, you know, try to see my grandparents. Mm. And hopefully it won't storm too bad so I can get down there. But yeah. not, I, I was on holiday for a while. So I'm going to kind of, like, catch my breath and yeah. get back in, in the saddle. But why? What do you got going down? Nothing. Oh. <laughs> I was just wondering. <laughs> was it's like, Friday. Oh, maybe, maybe you got something big going on here. Nah. That, that I don't know about that I need to be a part of or something like that. So nah. I can't believe it's already, I mean, August 7th today. I don't know why that shocks me so much, but you can, at least I can. I don't know if you agree, but you can definitely tell that, am I going to say this? Fall, fall is in the air. Like you wake up. I have to go. It's kind of, <clears throat> it's kind of dark. Last night, like typically when I go home, because I work late, I go home. I mean, look, well, that's cloudy, but like I'll go home and it, lately it's been nice enough I can kind of go out for a little just, roam around because it's so beautiful and last night I went out like the sun started going down I was like oh don't do this to me I right know. now soon the leaves will be changing Shh. Shh. just fingers crossed that we're gonna have a bison football season what are we gonna like literally what are we going to I do I don't know I do <laughs> I, honestly I've thought about that many like what what is this entire community they're just gonna be like what even if they have to put like the like we're the all going to be like on. this this fall. Just just, <laughs> <laughs> just put the uh, you know the faces and the stands. Put it on TV and just just yeah. play the game. Yeah, I'd be fine with that. Yeah, we got to touch on this. Speaking of, because here's the reality, and everyone's kind of like, oh, I don't know if we should do the season. Be, 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 are, are you being a DJ right now? No, I'm DJ listening B to you. DJ B Um You know, we got to play because if they can do this. We can have football in the Fargo Dome. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. You are still stuck under your dress. It's so funny to watch your brain right now. No, I'm listening to I you. I know you are, but I can see your thoughts. I don't know why I can, but I can. And it's just hysterical. So anyways, they're having the 80th annual Sturgis Motorcycle Rally, which means there's going to be like a quarter of a million people in a tiny town of Sturgis. So we can have... We'll throw the football. Exactly. We'll throw I'm glad the, you didn't do throw this. The cow I, thought, leather. I thought knowing you, you were going to be like, oh, then we can play football in the dome. 80th annual Sturgis. That's exciting. Have you ever been there? No. Not. I have never been. I I've, would stick out like a sore thumb. Driven, <laughs> you would show up with like a sparkly bike. <laughs> yeah. What's wrong with that? There's probably a lot of sparkly bikes down there, but it would be great to see you. It would be. So, anyways, I think it's fantastic that they're doing this. I'm, I'm assuming, obviously, most of it's outside, so they're going to be all good there. And uh, if you go down there and end up being a part of it, send us some pics and put them up on our Facebook page, please. Yeah, please send us pics. That'll be so exciting, so fun. A little bit of normalcy sprinkled in with this pandemic. You You're know. a very good listener. I think you should give yourself a more of a pat on the back. <laughs> well, it's going to be a fun Friday. I don't know what's going to happen. How Are you going to sing today? No. I'm trying. At some point, she will sing. But all right, stay with us. When we come back, we're going to be talking to the West Fargo Library. We're going to be talking about some delicious pizza and much, Ooh. much more.